Hi, it's Angeline. I'm back with a crafty video with Unity Stamp and today I'm going to show you a fun way on how to use the Thermoweb Decofall Flock Transfer Sheet. But first, I've already stamped this cute girl by Thierry Jackson called Little Bubbles with some Copic markers. And she's so cute, don't you think? And here, I've already cut some flock transfer sheets into strips uh, for us and they come in packages like this. They are 6x12 and they have 4 pieces in it and you can get these from Unity Stamp. These are so fun and fuzzy, I had to just get them and try them out. So I'm using the Thermoweb XL runner tape here because the head is kind of flexible as you will see next. It can go in waves like this if you want fun patterns uh, on your card. And once the adhesive is down, just put the flock pretty side down. And I'm grabbing my brayer here to just um, press more pressure into the flock to ensure everything sticks well to the adhesive. Once you're done, just slowly, carefully peel it out and ta da! You really should feel it in real life. It is so fuzzy. Uh, my goodness, I love this thing. It is a fun texture to add to your cart, and I think it's kind of cool. So, what's fun about this technique is you don't need any fancy tools or machines, all you need is your glue tape and a brayer. If you don't have that, you can use a bone folder or even your fingers. Just apply some pressure to it and you're done. So now that I'm happy with the background, I'm just using some tacky adhesive here to just um, adhere the girl and also the sentiment down. I'm also grabbing the Unity Stamp Aurora Borealis sequins here to add some bubbles to the card and some bling of course. Here I'm using my iCraft Mixed Media Adhesive by Thermoweb to just adhere the sequins down. So here is how the flock looks like. It's so fuzzy, you have to get these to try them out. So here is my finished card. I hope you enjoyed this technique today and thanks for watching. Bye!